Come on, guys. Just give give it a break, all right? Is slipping into tyranny. Who dares to find a commissioner? No one. Put me down, you big old. Oh! Oh! What the? Did somebody just blow up the police? What's up, guys? And welcome back to Giant Cop. So last episode was my first day on the job, and I gotta say, I feel like I did pretty well. You know, I don't mean to gloat, but we did manage to arrest a bunch of hippies and nudists. A lot of people that were just kind of minding their own business and having harmless fun, but they count. There's still arrests, okay? And even though it wasn't hard crime, I think that's gonna change today, because we're setting up a raid in Rusty Mills. Let me just get there real quick. Oh. Okay, I seriously do not enjoy doing that every freaking time. <laughs> like, I don't get it. They have bridges in between all of these areas. Why can't I just walk? Like, there's no excuse for me to have to travel through space's gaping rainbow vagina every time. So this is Rusty Mills, huh? There's some kind of dangerous crime going on here. We're setting up a raid over by that giant rock? They really shouldn't be inviting me to a raid. I would imagine I shouldn't be yelling it over the city. And when you see a 500 foot tall police officer, that kind of ruins the element of surprise. Woo. You see, I should just be able to do that across the bridge. Buddy, you had better not disappear on me again, okay? You always leave the heavy lifting for me. It's completely unacceptable. We're supposed to be buddy cops here. Well, you're supposed to be the buddy cop. I'm giant cop. So does that mean you're actually going to work with me for once? Hey! Hey! Put me down, giant cop! Oh, I'll, I'll put you down. First. Don't you worry. Find the weak spot in the roof. Yeah, I think I can see it. It's glowing and made of glass. You guys make that pretty obvious. <laughs> okay, I gotta know. This is for science, but at the same time, I'm sure he'll forgive me. Eh. <laughs> I love the little... spot in the roof. Huh. That's a pretty good trick. You're gonna have to teach me that someday. Find the weak spot in the roof. Yeah, I get it. The weak spot in the roof. I see it. Do I just throw you hey, through the weak spot in the roof? Down, Here. Eh. Ooh. Oh. I he he bounced. <laughs> oh yeah, Find that's the weak spot in the roof. That's not a concussion, apparently. Okay. Um how about a boulder? That'd be better? Yeah. Smash the glass, and I'll get in from above. Not bad. I'm still a little confused how this is going to work. We, we kind of lost the element of surprise when the 500-foot-tall police officer climbed up a mountain and started throwing boulders. It's working, though. How strong is this freaking glass? Skylight looks seriously compromised. Drop a few heavy objects on it, and it'll give way. What do you think I've been doing? Heavy objects, huh? Can I just throw anything? Is this insured? I, I guess we're gonna find out. Knock, knock. <laughs> Who's there? Giant, Giant cop? Who? Giant cop. Don't alert them. Now, carefully toss me inside the building. Carefully, hey, huh? Oh How's yeah, I'll carefully toss you inside that building. Oh, Just you wait. <laughs> He's dead, right? He has to be. The size of this place. We could have tossed you in here. Who would have tossed me? Giant, butter. giant cop. Those must be whole hot dogs. Ooh. While I search all the aisles, you survey the exterior. Check the parking lot. Shake whatever vehicles you consider suspicious. If you're gonna stick me with the crappy job, can you at least bring me out a hot dog? Okay, even if it's a little hot dog, I'll eat it like one of those little hot dog candies. So I need to go shake down trucks? Yeah, I, I guess I can do that. I'm, I'm pretty good at that. I found something. I found a box. Found anything? Yeah, box. Maybe you'll have more luck than me. Hello? Where the hell is everybody? I don't know. As far as I know, we're the only two cops in all of these cities. <laughs> I haven't interacted. Oh, you're gone. Okay. Well, um. Hey, put down the vehicle and come here. I've located the manager's office. Keypad lock. Contact the security company. They must be able to unlock this remotely for fire and safety reasons. Can you locate a phone? Wait, do you want me to locate a phone or do you want me to come here? Because I, I don't think I can fit. 
<laughs> Why do you always disappear when I have questions? Worst buddy cop ever. So, he wants me to find a phone. How am I supposed to find a phone? I'm 500 feet tall. Your phone here somewhere. That's not helpful. Excuse me, ma'am, up here. Uh, sorry to bother you. Oh, hello there. Hello there. I don't suppose you have a phone. You see a phone anywhere? I'm working on it. Will you calm down? Do you have a phone that I could borrow? Could I hey. shake it out of you? No? Oh. You got a phone? Hey. I feel like I'm going to give somebody severe whiplash doing this. Uh, no phone, huh? How do I delicately lay you down? There has to be a phone here somewhere. I swear to God. Okay, here's your new objective. I'm gonna send you in after him, and you're just gonna slap some sense into him. Go on with ya. I missed. Um, I should probably get going. Yep, time to hit the old dusty trail. Find a phone? No, I haven't found a phone. I found a drum. A drum that doesn't work. Never mind, it works. I gotta figure it out. Okay, there's a raid going on over here. Police raid. Anybody with savage cabbage, be aware. <laughs> I'm so indiscreet. Um, I mean, there are a ton of these around, right? Can you see a phone anywhere? I'm gonna throw this watch in the ocean soon. <laughs> I don't really care about the collectibles, to be completely honest, but they're all over the place. There has to be a phone, right? Where am I going to find a phone that's big enough for me? And why is there a clown on that roof? That needs to be investigated first. Be a phone here somewhere. I'm pretty sure that's a clown, right? Am I losing my mind? Excuse me, sir? Hello? Where did he go? That's creepy. He's... Oh, oh, it's... No, you weren't what I saw. The clown just transformed into a woman? You seem like a lovely young lady, but I can't be too certain that you're not an evil clown in disguise, so we're gonna have to do a quick test, okay? Clowns are deathly allergic to gravity. People, however, not so much, so let me just try this, where I'm gonna... Eh. Hold it for you, big guy. Oh yeah, that should do it. Find the phone. Okay. Now, verdict says... She's good! Not a clown! Okay, I I've solved the clown mystery. Can I... Oh, phone, right, phone. Um... Phone. Well, we have a set. Oh, a phone! I think I see a phone. Can you see a phone anywhere? Yeah, apparently I can. Found one. Good. Call this number. Five 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 one two one two. Why is there a giant operational phone on this building? That that is dedication to advertisement. Okay, this could just have been inflatable garbage. No one would have known. Five five five. One, two, one, two. Here we go. Welcome to Securico, where your safety is our business, or the police's. To talk to a member of I'm the police. Staff, press one. To talk with a member of our accounting team, press two. To talk to the guy in charge of opening locked doors in case of emergencies or police raids, press three. Police raids. Yeah, you know what? I think again. it's a three. There we go. Haven't got all day. Hey, I'm the manager. Oh, giant cop. You need a door open for the farmer's market? You've heard no of me. Problem. I'll just deactivate it from here. Let me just... Uh... You can do hey, that? Son. Should have popped right open. All right. You have a good one now, you hear? Uh, hello? Job, well... GC. I'm in. Let's see what they've got hidden away. Holy wow. Nobody present, but... I'm right now looking at one ginormous cabbage stash. Can you clear this door to the side for me? Like the window. Brute force. Take it out, giant cop. Yeah, I should be able to do that. Are we just going to glance over the fact that this guy can open a door from anywhere? That that kind of seems illegal. Okay, screw it. You're gone again. Um, Clearing a side door, huh? A forklift should do the trick, right? There we go. Keep it up, GC. Come on, you can squeeze through there. Stand back. No, no, stand right by it, please, by all means. Ooh. You've done it. Can you believe the quantity Be gentle, of cabbage? giant cop? I'm not a toy. You must be at least. Look at that mountain of cabbage. The good people of Micro City are in your debt, giant cop. Let's see the perps. Have to report that, unfortunately. There was no one at the scene, ma'am. Tipped off. 
There's going to be an inquiry once this is over. I'm going to want answers. We clear out this cabbage, and who's to say the farmers won't just restock it? No. We need to shut this operation down for good and make an example while we're at it. Giant cop, I'm dropping off demolition supplies. We'll toss an explosive device through the roof of the farmer's market. Yes, please. Um, I kind of have some questions, though. I, I mean, you said something fishy is going on. They were tipped off, and the fact that I'm holding Buddy, but he's also on the phone, makes me oh. a little bit concerned. <laughs> so we need to go up here. And what, what didn't they give me? Hey. How you doing, C4? I've dropped a demolition charge for you, Giant Cop. You need to throw it in through the roof of the farmer's market. Losing your resolve, Giant Cop? Or your nerve? Don't Detonate. you worry about it. Rid our city of this filth. Ridding city of filth, ma'am, don't you? Whoop, he's gone. I didn't even get to blow him up. <laughs> what would happen if I did just hit the button real quick? If I... Woo! Close, but no exploding cigar. They need to be dropped inside the farmer's market if we mean to terminate operations. You really can't just let me have my fun, huh? Okay, well... There you go, and skaboosh! <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> Alright, that was pretty impressive. <laughs> I hope Buddy was in there. Yes, yes! That'll send a loud and clear message. I will not let Micro City be slowly poisoned. They're out of business for good. But still, who could have tipped them off? There's no other way they could have known we were coming. It was Buddy. It was clearly Buddy. There's something weird going on with Buddy. Fireworks? I didn't have anything to do with those either. I don't even know where he went. Like, I was gonna blow him up and he just disappeared. I don't... Ooh, okay. Um... Yep, I don't see him anywhere. I don't see a whole lot of anything, to be completely honest. This is super nauseating. <laughs> it's like turning the field of view down to negative 100. Uh, yeah, he's, oh, yeah, he, he's nowhere to be seen. Oh, sorry, sorry. I keep forgetting that I'm a giant. <laughs> Throwing binoculars the size of a tank at pedestrians. You tiny people have no idea how good you have it. <laughs> Nobody is sending you through space and time, you and your little jogging pants. Hey. Rubber selves, you just bounce off of everything. Oh, I've never felt so old. Hey. What are you doing up there? Can I... Eh, got it, for whatever reason. Um... Huh. I mean, it's safe to assume that these two things can be combined together, right? Yeah, that that's a grand slam if I've ever seen one, but the real question is... Can I do something for you, officer? Yeah, let me know how Russia is this <laughs> time of year. <laughs> or, you know, the moon. There's so many random things around. Like, again, fully functioning tennis racket. That is a big dedication to marketing. You have to admire it. Is this Granny? Oh, no, it's you! Little Hillary Clinton woman. What do you want? May I have your attention, giant cop? Ah, uh, I mean, maybe, I guess. I could go find Granny and do an arrest. That might be kind of cool. Oh, great. Granny's down on the beach again. What is it that I can do for you today, my little old biddy? You looking to ruin some more people's People fun? People have no decency today. I can't go anywhere without seeing peckers and who has everywhere I look. I Hi. insist you arrest these naked, free-loving hippies immediately. More peckers and who has Really? I told you last time, Granny, you can't just arrest naked people because for every one naked person you arrest, two more people are going to take their clothes off. Think of all the money I'm saving not buying clothes. You see, it's practical. I, I hate doing this. I absolutely hate myself. One down, giant cop. Buddy, I told you to get her off the line. Oh, my God. I, I don't appreciate the people that I work with in the slightest. Are you staring at me? I mean, I probably could. You got a little naked bum on you. <laughs> okay, we're, we're doing well. You know, I think she wants me to arrest 10 more naked people. Uh, sir, sir. Oh, you can really feel the breeze. Oh, so Ow. much breeze, my dude. Whoa. <laughs> can you feel that in your taint? <laughs> I can only imagine. 
I'm seeing a whole lot of the same two people, and the funny thing is, they're always wearing shoes. <laughs> they're very careful to have their shoes on. <laughs> Can I? There we go. Nailed it. Okay. How are we doing? I think that's probably half a dozen or more. Uh, sir, haven't Ooh, seen you before. You can really feel the breeze. Yeah, feel that breeze through your tummy hair. Oh, I can see your little treasure trail. <laughs> oh, that's weird. Go away. The beach is cleaner than ever. Keep going. Oh, man. Like I said, I was going to hit real crime today. Feel all the money I'm saving. <gasps> I already heard that. Maybe I can just play with the beachgoers? Like, ma'am, catch this ball. Oh, 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 I killed somebody. Oh, she's dead. I hit her with a ball at like mock speed. <laughs> What's with the oil on the beach? Paint. There has to be some use to this, right? Oh. Kind of explodes and makes a big splooge puddle. Ma'am, you don't want to walk yes, through my splooge puddle. Up? It's very dangerous when you're on the beach naked. This is why it's against the law. There can't be many more of these hippies left, giant cop. Where are you, Granny? I'm. Oh, that dude just completely ate it. I didn't even do anything. <laughs> oh, that one exploded. That one didn't have any splooge in it. Oh, I'm. I'm sorry. Um, I think I only have a few people left, right? We're doing pretty well. Is there anybody left? <laughs> Again, it's a great deterrent when you pick up little naked people. Like what you see, giant cop. Oh, stop you. <laughs> Justice has been served, giant cop. Now that you've cleaned up the beach, I can keep my eyes open while I take my titties for a walk. Okay, Granny, you enjoy your titty walk. I know she probably said kitty walk, but at the same time, titty walk would be a great name for an Asian restaurant, right? I would totally eat at the titty walk. Now, what did you want? Do you want to... Take off your little overcoat and show us what you're packing. We've set up telescreens throughout Micro City. I'm going live with news of the farmer's market destruction. The evolving situation calls for new measures. Unfortunately, the farmers are angry. Eliminating the cabbage supply has meant the loss of their main source of income. They have to accept that they were necessary collateral damage and cease protesting immediately. We have to maintain a hard line. Arrest all protesters. People of Micro okay. Tonight, you can sleep easier in the knowledge that coordinated police actions and the heroic conduct of Giant Cop have all but eradicated Savage Cabbage from our community. I don't like her. Today, the main distribution center for the cabbage was found and destroyed. Many of the cabbage dealers are still at large, but they will be found and they will face the full force of justice. More farmers to locate, giant cop. Yeah, I see them. They're all over the place. I just, I, I kind of want to side with them. I don't like you. You're ruling with an iron fist of, I want to speak to your manager haircut. Sir, there's no need to wet your pants, okay? I'm just going to throw you at mock speed into the police station portal. But again, I want to let you guys know that I apologize. I, I do this because I need the, to locate, the job, okay? I'm on it, ma'am. God, get off my nuts. Cop. There he goes, one. Ooh, okay, that one's crippled. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. He'll never farm again. Anybody who wants to perform a death-defying stunt, raise your hand. Or your pitchfork. Yeah, that works too. Okay, perfect. Thank you. There's one. Put me down. No, put you down over there. What about you? What about due process? Yeah, your due process will be in jail. Most of these dirt bags aren't even from Micro City. How dare they dictate how we run our city? Where are they from then? Kind of weird that they just get access to all the roofs. I don't care what you have to say. <laughs> I just want to get the job done, okay? I got better things to we do. We are only the beginning. Cool. Anybody who was confused, this is where new farmers come from. I'm happy we could clear that up. You are making our streets safer, giant cop. Who will feed my city? I don't know. The grocery stores? I really doubt we get everything from you people, or else we'd be starving right now. You're all hanging out on roofs. Now, as soon as this mission started, I saw you guys knock these maracas off the roof, and I really don't appreciate it, because these are my maracas. Find the rest of the trespassers, giant cop. Can you just Their let me have fun for, like, two seconds? Like God, okay, I'm on it, I'm on it. There, there. 
Well, Everybody's arrested. Th that's all of them, I'll right? Make them pay for it. You just say you were gonna make a build a wall and make them pay for it? what? Oh my God! I'm working for female Donald Trump. Oh, she's like Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump. This is the worst. I think I got them all right. I don't see any more protesters. Hi, little pimp. It's good to see you today. Hey, I just did my hair. Oh, I'm sorry. Here, let me lay you down on the roof there. <laughs> Do you two have any idea how long it took me to find you? As adorable as we you are both are, you need you to go to jail, okay? Don't, don't, don't jump, okay? You, I'll, I'll put you down in a minute. You have so much to live for. Let me just, oh, that one bounced, okay? And there we go. There's Is that all of them? That has to be all of them. Over by the sports shop. You're my hero, giant cop. No, you're my hero. You know what? You you just keep macking on the, the women. Okay, you know, pimping ain't easy and all that stuff. I'm, I'm just gonna put you down right right around there. There we go. She's, oh, there are a couple more, okay. Come on, guys. Just give give it a break, all right? slipping into tyranny. Who dares to find a commissioner? No one. Put me down, you big Oh, oh, what the? Did somebody just blow up the police station? Holy crap! Holy crap! Oh, that is outside my pay grade. Was that the farmers? They imagined they can trifle with us. They will pay dearly for this. Giant cop, find any witnesses and make them talk. Everybody witnessed that. Everybody in the city clearly witnessed that. That was huge. That was the last thing that I expected to happen. <laughs> like, things escalated pretty quickly, from swinging pitchforks on roofs and spray painting stuff to blowing up Shake the middle of the down, city. Cop. Not resting until we know who is responsible for this. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm on it, looking for witnesses. There's paint everywhere. Like, every can of paint exploded from the shockwave. <laughs> I don't know what a witness looks like. Like, clearly everybody witnessed this, sir. Hey there. Do you see anything? You've been working out. Do you lift? Look at the pecs on you. Oh. I'm supposed to gentle. shake people down to see if they're witnesses. You have a lovely little rainbow ascot today, sir. I, I, I love everything you got going Somebody on right now. Something. Keep looking for witnesses. I'm working on it. Is it bad that I really, really hope Granny was caught in that explosion? I haven't heard anything from her, so there's a possibility. It also looks like Godzilla blew a load on that building. <laughs> I don't see any witnesses, lady. If you're not gonna give me any advice as to what a witness looks like, then I I'm gonna say that we're done here, right? There's a whole lot of regular looking people. Shake them down, giant cop. Not resting until we know who is responsible They're for just this. walking around. Do I just pick- There was a guy I saw earlier. Looked a bit shifty. Kept his face covered. The innocent don't wear masks. Canvas more witnesses. Oh! Witnesses look like everybody else, of course! You got anything else? Come on, speak up. No, okay, you've been very helpful, sir. Thank you very much. Okay. Oh my god. Um. Um. You okay? They went into the police station with a balaclava on 20, maybe 30 minutes ago. Feeling safer with you here, giant cop. This is classic terrorist profile, giant cop. <laughs> I feel safer with you here, giant cop. You're not dropping people on cars and having them explode. Whee! She's fine. How about you? Beautiful day. No? Whee! Okay. Great day for it, officer. How you doing there, Bob? Three people for sure. All wearing, like, little ski mask things. Jumped into okay. a van and sped off. But I couldn't tell the make of the van. Organized conspiracy. Exactly as we suspected. Get a detailed description of that vehicle and its heading. Okay, we're looking for a van. That was very helpful, okay? Uh, premium points for you. You can go investigate the site. There we go. Okay, um, we're looking for a van. Hey, you, you seen a van? Beautiful day. Beautiful day, what? indeed. Van. I'm not giving my name, but I did see a black vehicle. Don't want to get involved. Black van, okay. A black truck? Hey, I just did Sure, my I hair. saw a black truck. A black truck? What are truck? they going to do to me if they find out I told you? Oh, they're not going to do anything. Trust me, you got giant cop on your side. Black, <laughs> black truck. <laughs> Don't worry, man. With giant cop in your corner, you're sure to explode. Okay, we're looking for a black truck, but where'd it go? Black van? Sure, I saw a black van. Black van? Black truck? What are they going truck? to do with me? 
If they Make up your mind. Black van? Uh, black van? Black truck? Black truck? Not giving my name, but I did see a black vehicle. Don't want to get involved. Okay, okay. Black vehicle? Oh, did she just have something else to say? Crap. Maybe I shouldn't have lost my cool Not there. Not giving my name, but I did see a black vehicle. Don't want to get involved. So you don't want to get involved. What would happen if I shook you? Okay, okay. You didn't hear it from me, but the black van was one of those classic wanderer models with the stripes on the side. That's Ooh. a very distinct vehicle with the target painted on its side. They are begging to be caught. Okay. Black van, stripes, some, something on the side. You got anything else for me? Do you want to get sent to the sun? Talk to me. Okay, no, I think she's, 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 whoop. She's probably dead. Okay, we're looking for a black van. I didn't get a heading though. Strong grip. Thank you. Black van, yeah, I don't know. I'd say in the direction of Micro Vista, but that's a guess. Ooh, Micro Vista? Jeez, okay, I'll talk. They're definitely going to Micro Vista. Terrific policing, giant cop. Everything indicates that the targets are in the suburbs. I'm monitoring police band radio, trying to narrow down their 20. Okay, that was some actual police work. I may have abused my power and uh, possibly sent a witness to Africa, but you know, it was good. Another complaint just called in by the old lady in Micro Vista. Can't be a coincidence. Investigate. We really shouldn't trust that old lady. I don't think she's looking for a schmer, schmer, schmists. They're definitely looking for, you know, peckers and stuff like that. You know what? I think that's going to be it for this episode of Giant Cop, guys. And I got to say, I'm even more impressed with this game after this episode than I was the first one. There's just so much to do and so many random little things to see and hear and big unexpected events that I would love to play more. So if you guys want to see more, as always, be sure to leave a like in the video. Let me know. And then maybe we'll return to see what's going on with this van. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time.